Hey guys, and today we have the review of uh, Mi 8. So the phone is quite old, but it's still updated to Mi UI 12.5 in 2022. But it's really good for such old phone that still has some updates. Uh, this update is Mi UI 12.5 EU, uh, uh, Xiaomi EU from European Union. That's how it's called, but that uh, update is still running on this phone, so you still have some function and it's really, really good. So let's see, let's have some review. So it still looks uh, like regular. So you have uh, here the security patch, is it still from 2020? Yeah, sorry for my phone language, it's still like my native language, but still <laughs> that's good to review. But this uh, this uh, software, this hard, the software, this firmware it has all the languages here, and always it has in Xiaomi EU it always has more features and global language and update and always up to date. The global version still not available, but this Xiaomi EU version it's available even now you can update it. So you have Google Play update first uh, of November 2022, 21. Sorry, yeah, so it's. Actually, not that modern, but still uh, not bad. It's still updating. So you have networks function here, no updates. Wi-Fi. From Wi-Fi, you have additional settings, uh, nothing special here. So you have Wi-Fi assistant, uh, also was before. So basically, not much updates in this uh, section. Uh, Bluetooth, mm, additional settings, mm, nothing more. Yeah, the same as on previous version. Uh, connections, so you have me share. This uh, me share works quite a long time. So this sh uh, screencast also was before. Uh, what else? Let's move on. Yeah, this we uh, skip. Uh, what else? Personalization, uh, like design. You also some design adjustments here, so you see how modern it looks like. So you have. Uh, uh, this uh, screen that always on screen so they also add some more designs as always and still works quite good uh, what else uh, lock screen uh, here uh, is the same it's a dep like this uh, always on that's still the same yeah basically no changes sound also redesigned a bit but still the same desktop like launcher you have a uh, search bar here you can activate it uh, before it was not available here but now this line is available uh, what else uh, and yeah i just disable it it's more convenient uh, let's move on also you have some widgets uh, here yeah now you see the new design updated of the widget so it's quite big up quite big bottom of widget here but when you click it you still have similar widgets so let's wait maybe MIUI 13 will come and we have some updates let's move on the password and security nothing special yeah, protection battery so basically in the settings uh, also not much changes still the same some scenario set it but it's yeah nothing special additional settings you have uh, one one hand usage. You have sensor screen assistant. Uh, so also no changes. You can change the region now. It was not available in previous version, so you can put I don't know India, Brazil, Germany, any country. So I don't know how influ how it influence, uh, but it's available. Okay, I have focus mode here. You can search 30, 60, 90 minutes, and then once you click it, you cannot even restart your phone. It still will be in this focus mode. So it means you can not use your phone. It's co actually convenient if you want to concentrate on something. And it was on iPhone for a long time, actually. So finally it's added here. Additional functions. So you have uh, here some windows, like uh, floating windows. So it's also from UI 12.5. Uh, it was not available before. So you can put, uh, like you see, your open window and scroll it 
it doesn't work. Ah, okay, so it works now. So I can move it down and they show how we can use it. So we can close them, we can open them from a notification, like just scroll down and then you will open it. You can make full screen out of it and you can pin it on a top in a small window like this. So also maybe convenient for someone like YouTube app that usually ask to pay for this uh, floating screen. You can make it for free now. So this is quite a new function. Good that they added this to this old phone. And uh, nothing more here. So let's check disadvantages. So you cannot remove uh, the uh, pre-installed apps. They pro sell me promise to remove it, but you see this button is not available. So I will try to remove this, but uh, you see you cannot disable it, you cannot remove it, so really not convenient. The same with uh, health app. It's pre-installed apps that uh, are not necessary on this phone, but you still cannot remove them. That's not convenient. What else? Uh, all the other uh, pre-installed apps, uh, like stock apps, look the same. Watches, mm, basically, let's check the settings. Uh, yeah, you have some new music and new style, as you see, looks quite nice, but still the same functionality, actually. So just more about some minor correction design changes. Also, you have some other settings of alarm, but still, yeah, just minor correction, not really something modern. In general, that's all main updates that, uh, that this phone has right now with MIUI 12.5. Of course, uh, they can have some other updates, but still, I think uh, that will be the latest version for this because the phone is 2018, so it's four years old, and Xiaomi will, I don't think they, they will update it uh, again. So basically, uh, MIUI 13 this phone will not get, and just let's, uh, let's concentrate this. Uh, this one is the latest one. It works quite well, maybe missing some function like memory extension as they were introduced in uh, in like newest MIUI 13. Maybe they will add it, maybe no. So just let's hope that they will update finally to MIUI 13. Actually, I also found that uh, some guys just transported this MIUI 13 to Mi, Mi 8 from some other phone, like Xiaomi phone that was officially updated. I don't know how it works, uh, seems that it doesn't work that well, but you know, maybe those guys who are working hard, they will make it look good and I can install this one on my phone and show you guys how it looks like. And uh, that's it, leave your comments below, put a thumbs up and see you with the further update, hope me 13 of course.